All right, so today I'm here with my boss. Um, how do you want me to address you? <laughs> As your small boy. <laughs> oh, my big man. I'm here with you, yes. I'm here with my big man. Uh, yeah. uh, I call him Ike for short. Yeah. Uh, you have a YouTube channel, right? Yes, I do. And, um, can you give us the name? Uh, Zikonis Studios GH. Zikonis. Oh, please, can you spell the Zikonic? Um, Z E K O R N I Z. Z E K O R N I Z. N I Z. Yes, yes. So is it, very soon you'll be, you'll be seeing things there. Oh, yes, yes. Very soon, very soon. Yes, I, um, you're welcome. Thank you very much, my boy. Yeah. Big man. Bigger oh. man. Bigger man. <laughs> um, you, you are a rapper. Are you a former rapper or you are still, the interest is still there? Yeah, former rapper. Former rapper. But so now, you've given up rap now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But now I'm into more of um, R&B, high life, and all those stuff. It means he, Ike is still in the music industry. Oh, yes, industry. yes. Under G, under G. <laughs> nice, nice, nice. You know, people like you, someone like you, if, if I hadn't gotten closer to you, I wouldn't have known that you you ever did music. See. I wouldn't have known. I think it was a conversation that even brought that up. Yes, yes. And I was so shocked. <laughs> and later, I remember you gave me some rap lines. You see, you then tie them old rap things. <laughs> yeah, and you know, it, it's the same out there. There are people who, uh, should I say, had great interest in music, mm. but for some other bigger interest they had, they felt that oh, way this is delaying. So yeah. let's just find something to do because music is such that you do it for some time if it's not picking up. You feel like no, let me try other things. That's so, true. That's I remember true. my big brother mm -hmm. also played um, classic handles with Kujwenji. Oh, I see. Uh, before wow. he started working with the Kolibu teaching hospital. Right okay. after he got the salaried work, he forgot about oh, his dreams. You see, we have one medical doctor too, Doctor Nilante. Mm. Very great singer. He's also with the Kolibu still now, now, now. now. I see. Uh, so, you know, this tells you that there are so many people out there to who may be talented than even the people we have in the industry right now. Oh, that's, yes, that's true. You know, that's true. But only a few were able to find their way into the limelight. So sometimes when criticism, criticism comes mm -hmm. and then some of the artists are feeling that, oh, the rest, those people out there don't know anything. Sometimes the, the journalist who is even interviewing the artist mm -hmm. is even a better artist than the artist is interviewing. That is true. But the that artist may not know. Or when Philly say, oh, this is just a journalist. Yeah. So there are some questions you may ask and you go like, oh, but you for no ask me this question mm -hmm. and all that. Mm -hmm. You know, recently we've we we witnessed um, Miss G and then yeah. medical medical didn't understand why Miss G should ask setting questions but clearly for medical in issue bro how is here well um i must say that um miss v should have focused on the reason for the interview okay he had uh, a show at the o2 right yeah the o2 uh, which was okay. a massive thing that he did i sold out uh -huh. a very yeah, yeah, show. yeah yeah so i'm i'm sure that was why he was called on the show for that yeah. interview it wasn't about his um relationship with fella okay so if if i'm sure if they had talked about before that oh we mm -hmm. would ask you about your former relationship then he might have given you, consent would have been uh -huh. but just to boom like that you give the artist the chance to tell you off so yeah. i think this is an eye okay. opener mm -hmm. for people who interview others if you think you want to address certain delicate issues let them know beforehand i think it's it's a good yes choice. and they have the right to say they want to talk about it or not mm. they have the right uh, sometimes yes yes sometimes true. people who interview this thing like because they have the stuff they can ask any question but no ethics are very very important here you need to know which areas to go and which areas not to go unless you have discussed with the artist you cannot just ask any question yeah. but i like the way medical went about it he showed that he knew his rights and then he expressed himself very yeah. very well 
maturely unlike others who would come and insult you for those who insult what i say is it's they are just telling you their kids <laughs> did you have you watched medical in full video i haven't watched the full thing but with the one i watched i didn't see him insult so if he okay. did that then fine because there were other videos where he was using some vulgar languages you know, and all. Uh, no. he attacked for the big scene oh. and all of that and people were not too happy with yeah, it you see yeah, these yeah. big men we call them the industry gatekeepers mm. um if you have an issue i i also believe that medica could have spoken to father dixon mm -hmm. maybe on phone yes so father maybe yeah. i say 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 but um miss g's question Angasano, bro what i'm also thinking is that mm -hmm. um already know uh, medical and his relationships mm -hmm. haven't been a secret okay yeah um me for one i've always admired um fella and medical's kind of marriage because I'm that kind of person. I love to do things with the woman I love. And I know. That. I know that about you. always dancing. <laughs> yeah. Always. It like was a cool everywhere. thing they had. And the girl is another, I don't know how to. How Vibrant to, Oh, lady. I just like the lady. Mm. You know, and like Medica had a, has a taste for that kind of woman. woman, yeah. woman. Yeah. Because if you look at the Deborah Vanessa, mm. it's a Debbie. Yeah, she also another. Yeah, another, you know, so it was yeah. a beautiful relationship. Doesn't like and, dog girls. He likes. The